Hey everybody, TBG Hunter here, and welcome back to more Pikmin. Last time, we got a couple more ship parts up in the Forest Naval, or not the Forest Naval, the Distant Spring, and unfortunately, we had a lot of casualties that day, both in terms of battle and also leaving a lot of Pikmin behind. In fact, I think, yeah, that is actually the only other time we've lost Pikmin due to leaving them behind, and oh boy, did I really feel that pain. Anyways, we're going to be heading back to the Distant Spring because, well, it's the only place for us to go. And we're going to hopefully up our blue numbers as well as get a couple more ship parts. We did open up a lot of new areas here and we opened up the interior of the Distant Spring. So maybe we should probably go and look towards exploring around there. Alright, first things first, I see that there is a Pikmin in the ground over there, and unfortunately, I couldn't get lucky enough with the fact that we lost all our blues to some Wallywogs. Yeah, unfortunately, none got seated. Thankfully, uh, there's just a blue sitting right here. We'll pluck him, and let's get ourselves... I want to say around 30 blues. I get 30 blues, we're gonna make the... Uh, actually, no. Hold off on the reds for a second, because I want to get six... Eh, let's go with ten yellows. And we'll make the remainder of our Pikmin reds. Okay, there we go. Thankfully, because we have taken care of the swooping stitch bugs around here, as well as the bull bears, uh, this little area around where the base camp is, is actually pretty safe. Uh, actually, you know what? Okay, it's a bud, not a flower at least. Speaking of flowers... Let's get a couple of flowers working on that. And while they work on that, let's take the battalion up this way. Now, we got a Wallywog sitting over there between us and yet another ship part. Actually, we got a couple of Wallywogs sitting over there, but I think we could probably lure that one back there away. <laughs> All right, let's just get his attention, have him flop on over here, or dance in place, like an idiot. Okay, there it goes. Have him hop a little bit more towards the land. There we go. All right, and now we swarm him. Finish him off, finish him off. There we go. That is the proper way to take care of a Wallywog. All right, uh, looks like I can... All right, let's see if I can actually draw that wall walk away for a moment. Actually, in fact, I probably don't even need to these Pikmin on breaking down that. All right, fine, you guys can take that. I want to go and see if I can lure this boy away so that way we can get our blues working on this uh, wall over here. Come on. Come on, hop on over here. Very good, very good. Come on, a little bit further. I can have you just hop right over this limb. There we go. Alright, this is your new home now. What the, you idiots! Oh my god, you guys are such idiots. I was wondering why I was seeing blue over here for a second. It was like, wait, why am I picking the numbers going down? Oh god, you idiots, you really are being that stupid, huh? All right, fine. You know what? You guys just take that. You need your numbers back up. Don't you even think about it. Blues, you come with me. You get to work on this. And as for my yellows, let's get you guys over here. I don't think... Yeah, we didn't lose any yellows. It was just purely, purely reds that all got killed there. Let's get you guys grabbing some bomb rocks. I think that is everything. Okay, cool. So we got our yellows with our bombs. Let's split you guys up a bit. And let's get you guys on over here to help break down this wall. Because that's going to take forever for our reds, blues, and yellows to just bash down. Yeah, here we go. Four bombs and basically it goes down like nothing. That's still taking its time to come down, so I guess in the meantime, we can take our little squad right here, and we can just do a little bit of exploration. Uh, you know what? You guys get to work on seeing if there's any nectar over there. We got ourselves a bit of a puzzle over here. Oh god, Sheerwigs. I'm just gonna go this way instead, and 
surprised there is... Oh God, this place is just sheer wood heaven, huh? Surprised there's not more bull bears than there there have been. And I'm also surprised that we haven't seen any dwarf bull bears. Usually there's like around like two to three surrounding the parents playing around and having a good time. But unfortunately, or I guess in this case, fortunately, doesn't seem to be the case. We, uh, if we do want to get another ship part, we are going to have to do... Uh, maybe we can sneak past that one. But that puffy blowhog up there is probably going to annoy us, especially the one over there as well, because there's another ship part over there. Alright, there we go. <sighs> I hate the fact that you cannot save Pikmin when they get snatched by these guys. Guys. Come on, come on, take him out, take him out. There we go. Alright, uh, sitting back here, being guarded by a Wally Woggy. You know what, let's, let's play a little bit of, of a mind game with him. Take our blues. Take them over here. And find ourselves the Zirconium Rotor. This is made from rust-proof zirconium, which is particularly suited for making spaceship parts. I had to pay a lot extra to have this installed, and I suspect the mechanic overcharged me. As I said, Olimar having some serious buyer's remorse, and thankfully, I have just enough blues to help carry this back to the ship. Alright. So, for the time being, let's get you guys back over here. And we'll save the ship part that's in that little stump area for later. Because if I want to get that part, I want to take care of that Wally Wog. Alright, got a lot of buds over here. Got a lot of reds as well. Here's the yellows bringing back their kill. Was I thought it was actually reds that were going to be taken back the sheer wig, but nope, doesn't seem to be the case. Maybe a couple did, and I just didn't see it. Okay, let's see. Blues are slowly making their way back here. And if we want to take care... Oh, why is he awake? Why is he wide awake? Why, why are they awake? N nothing really woke him up. But of course, he had to reposition himself and put himself right between us and the ship part. Alright, well, at least it, it keeps them separate from the blowhogs, so if I can just get the Pikmin over here. This is seriously one of the worst areas for this guy to be at. Oh boy. Uh-oh. What is going on? Guys, run. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh, yeah. And I think I lost those other reds as well. Well, at least that ship part got back safe and sound. Zirconium rotor made of rust proof zirconium. It is as shiny as new, despite being left out in the planet's harsh elements. Now we're covered 24 out of 30 parts. Only five more to go, and our ship will be able to lift off much further. I hate you so much. Oh my god, I can... Alright, you know what? Let's see if I can actually just take care of this guy. Alright, he's in a bad spot. Thankfully, I can get him without having to risk my opinion go flying all over the place. There we go. Okay. Now that he is dead, let us go and get some reinforcements because of all the Pikmin that we have lost to some very, very, very stupid luck. Uh, actually, no. I want to get some yellows instead because what we need to do is we need to have a... Okay, actually, we know we have enough yellows for what I want to do. Alright, in that case, let's just get some reds for the extra firepower. Already progressed through midday, and where are the remaining two Pikmin? All right, there's a red over there, and there's a red blown all the way over there. Holy hell, you went flying, buddy! All 
Okay, come on, everybody. Oh, he's all the way over there. All right. Let's get right behind this bulbous fellow and go for that booty. There we go. And why not? Let's get some revenge for your fallen brothers. Or get easily distracted. Okay, go for the booty. There we go. That's for my reds and yellows, you jerk. Alright. I want to just have my reds. Reds, you have definitely suffered the most out of all the Pikmin here so far. Mainly from your stupidity, but also because of just really bad enemy placement. So, for the time being, let's have you guys carry back the bull bears. At least some of the yellows didn't actually pitch in on the... Oh my god, you guys, come on. I don't need yellows helping out with that. I need yellows helping out with something else. Reds, this is your job. Your job, should you choose to accept it, is to bring this bulbous creature back to your house for consumption. Alright, fine. Here, you guys take the red pellet. Blues. Blues. I only need blues. Let's get you guys carrying back the blue and yellow pellet over there, just so you can get some extra numbers. And there. You guys can carry that back as well. As for my yellows, we're going to go on a bit of an adventure over here. I want to take you guys, and we have just enough yellows, I believe, to do this. I'm go on up over here. And then just maneuver them quite carefully. And sitting right up there is yet another ship part. And it's one only yellows can reach because, well, they're the ones who fly the highest. There we go. And with that, they have acquired... My UV lamp! The only problem with this handheld light is that it can be too bright at times. I have to remember to wear my sun visor when I look into it. Or, you know, don't stare directly into it, Olimar. You ever thought about that? Alright, 25 Pikmin. Uh, I don't think we're going to be able to get another ship part. However, I do want to try to make that area a bit safer. So that way, when we come back here tomorrow, we can explore that place to our heart's content and not have to worry about... Wow, you got blown pretty high, dude. Uh, we don't have to worry about uh, any bull bears harassing us. Wally Wongs? Yes. Bull bears, thankfully, no. All right, just want to check. Okay, no Pikmin are left out in the wilderness except for this one who is sitting right here. It would honestly be very sad if he was the only one that got left behind and he was literally just like a few feet away from the base camp. Alright, let's see. All the blues are back at base, thankfully, and the bull bear over here seems to be the only enemy left in the area. The leagues are dead. Oh yeah, and there's also the puffy blowhog over there, but he's more of an annoyance than a threat. Alright. Go! Oh god, that might be bad. I swear, I better not have terrible luck because the yellows finally decided to be resourceful for once. This handy light is great for tanning, but it doesn't seem to have any relation to the dolphin's flight capabilities. I doubt that it will affect my escape from this planet. Perhaps there are other parts like this as well. Either way, we have got 25 out of 30 parts, just four more to go. Go, 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 go. Oh, this is bad. Go, 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 go. He's only got a sliver of health left. Come on, guys. There we go. All right. And just so we can up your numbers back in, because it looks like we lost five of you to him. Hopefully, you don't pull a blue and you're able to get back to base camp safe and sound. This is why I'm going to shadow you guys the entire way back. Probably should take the remaining reds, or maybe I should take my blues since we're gonna be needing more blues instead of reds tomorrow. Eh, whatever. There was still a patch of nectar over there we could probably go and slurp up. Yeah, just a patch. So, 
First come, first serve, boys. Drink them. All two of you. Alright. Oh, well, it's almost sundown. And thankfully, this time, everybody is back at base camp safe and sound. Just wish I didn't have a leaf battalion with me, and I wish I had a little bit more flowers in my group, but oh well. Nothing a little bit of nectar won't save. Alright, there we go. All 100. And just a few more seconds, and it'll be nighttime. I'm not seeing any patches of grass we can quickly pluck. Oh, wait, is that it? Oh, yes it is. Alright, you know what? Let's just see what we can get. Let's just see how many flowers we can get before the day's over. Come on, drink up, boys. Drink up. Time for a midnight snack. Alright, there we go. Ooh, got a nice assortment of flowers out of that one. I think, yeah, all but two, uh, two, three reds are flowers. Looks like all but one yellow is a flower, and I think all my blues are flowers. It was a rough day, not gonna lie, but you know what? We still made the most of it in the end. Not this time, Sherwigs. You're not getting a late night snack tonight. I hope you starve. 13 days since impact. If I can just find five more parts, the dolphin will be fully rebuilt. But time has grown short. I must not flag in my search. Even if I cannot recover every piece, I will not give up. Surely some of those parts aren't absolutely necessary. I can almost see my smiling family. <sighs> 34 were lost in battle today, but I'm gonna chalk a majority up to those being reds being very, very stupid and deciding to go for a swim. Other than that, uh, none to the Wallywogs and a couple to some bull bears and that really jerkishly placed uh, Puffy Blowhog. But still, we didn't leave anybody behind, so I'm counting that as a victory. And we also got a good assortment of flowers at the very end of the day. Alright. That's going to do it for today. Next time on Pikmin, we're going to continue searching the interior of the Distant Spring for the remaining four ship parts. And who knows, maybe if we luck out, we might be able to get all four of those in the next day. See you guys next time. Later.